Hey everyone, thanks for tuning into the Performance Lab. Don't forget to subscribe below to the right for updates to new videos and a huge announcement coming up. Enjoy. All right, so here's a quick video of an exercise to help you with landing with your foot underneath your hip when you're sprinting. A lot of times what ends up happening is as you're going, you end up landing with your foot out in front, right, which then impacts what your overall contact time is and also impacts how much force you can create into the ground. And so what we're going to need to do is we're going to just work on being a little bit taller up on your toe. When you're running, you are a little bit taller up, okay? Overall, you just want to have that, that upright posture. If you're sinking down, then you're not getting as much speed as you can. So we're at more of an upright posture and we're just working on being able to get that knee up, extending and then pulling and landing with that foot in a more, you don't want to be too much on your toe, you don't want to be on your heel, you want to be right in the middle part of your foot, okay, right around there is where you want to be landing as you're doing this exercise. So that's what really the goal is being able to, to get repetition of landing with your, in that part of your foot and with your foot right underneath you and just being able to, to maximize that the best you can. See right there, I landed with my foot a little bit further in front, which is normal when you're running, not every time is it gonna be perfect, right? But we wanna be able to drill it, we wanna be able to work it, make it so you can get better at being able to push off that, that right part of the ground as we're sprinting, which will help us getting better turnover and creating more and more force downward into the ground as you're running. All right, let me know if you have any questions, it's a quick little exercise to help you out. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you really enjoyed it. And if you did, you can subscribe down below and that way you can get updates on any of the new videos that we get. Also, if you want to, you can check out some of our other breakdowns for speed and throwing. We have exercises, also jumping mechanics videos, a lot of great stuff within our channel. Hope you enjoy.